This behind me is our public nursery in North London, where we keep some of our finest specimens on display. If you know our company, you'll know we love Japanese plants. And today I'm going to show you one of the things we're most proud of here at Paramount Plants, our collection of mature Japanese cloud trees, or Niwaki. Before we begin, it's important that you know that all of the trees you're about to see are available on this site and on our website. They're individually listed, meaning you can pick the exact one you want, whether you're here or in the Highlands of Scotland, and have it turn up at your door. With that in mind, let's begin. Niwaki literally means garden tree, but it refers to the process of shaping plants in these complex and delicate ways. Unlike European gardening, which tends to try and keep plants in rigid, geometric shapes or to let them run near wild, Japanese gardening uses human intervention to accentuate the natural beauty of a plant. To make this possible, you have to use a slow growing plant to make sure you can maintain the shape. And consequently, most of these plants will be older than me. Even the smallest will be no younger than a decade. These are the life's work of some of the finest gardeners alive. No two specimens are alike. Every angle reveals some artful detail which was missed at first glance. The very definition of a living sculpture. Most of our cloud trees are Japanese holly, or Ilex cronata. It's very slow growing with a dense evergreen habit formed of these lovely tiny leaves, which makes it ideal to be formed into these wonderful shapes. It doesn't really mind what soil it's in, as long as it's rich and well draining, and it's very easy to care for too. Just cut off this new growth once a year to keep it in shape. It doesn't mind the cold either. It does need two things, protection from wind and a semi-shaded spot that and plenty of water and you'll have an astounding garden feature to admire for decades to come. However, not all our cloud trees are Ilex granata. There are usually several pines in our collection, as well as several juniper trees. This large tree is an Osmanthus, famous for the sweet scent of its blooms. These enormous camellias will produce large red flowers from the soil to the tip right through early spring. Something really special is this beautiful Azalea Satsuki which flowers in white and pink for several weeks in the summer. Maintaining these plants remains roughly the same no matter what species you get. Most of our species prefer a rich, well-draining, neutral to acidic soil. If you get something like an azalea or a camellia, you'll need a more acidic soil. To keep them in their wonderful shapes, get a pair of secateurs like these and cut the new growth off once a year. Curve the blade downwards over the branch like so. You may also want to add some plant food or mulch to the soil every couple of years to keep it in the best possible condition. They will also need lots, and I mean lots, of watering. We have an entire other video about how to properly water your plants, but I'll still say it again, overwatering is not an issue. Unless water is actually sitting on the soil and not draining for a long time, you won't overwater them. And believe me when I say, it's better to give them a bit too much than too little. It would be an absolute tragedy for one of these plants which so much craft and dedication has been put into to get scruffy for the lack of a little water. So if you're going to invest in one of these marvels, do yourself another favour, make sure to keep it in top condition as we do here in our nursery. I know of nowhere else in the UK you can see the kind of collection we have here at Paramount Plants. To see the full address of this nursery, go to the Contact Us page on our website, and if you can't make it down here, check our constantly updating Cloud Trees page to see everything we have individually photographed and described so that you can pick the perfect tree for you. And for any further questions, email salesteam at paramountplants.co.uk.